Welcome back to KAC. In this video, I'm showing you a simple way of making a vibrant blackberry plating powder at home. Start by setting up a sheet pan with a rack on top of it and add a sill pad or a piece of parchment on top of the rack. For this recipe, all you need ingredients wise is blackberries. Simply place them in a blender and blitz them up until smooth. You should hit me with a splash gun. Push the pureed blackberry mixture through a strainer to remove any seeds. Use an offset spatula to smooth the blackberry puree onto the sill pad to form a thin layer. The thinner it is, the more rapidly it will dehydrate. When you're finished that, just place your pan into a preheated oven that's preheated to the lowest temperature your oven allows. Mine was at 150 Fahrenheit. The next part is the difficult part. It's waiting. This will usually take between 8 to 12 hours to fully dehydrate. You'll know it's properly dehydrated and ready to turn into a powder when once pulled from the oven and cooled slightly, the sheet of blackberry snaps when broken. Now to turn it into a powder. The best way that I've found, and it's likely that you have this equipment already, is by using a coffee or spice grinder. All you do is break the dehydrated blackberry puree into smaller pieces. Then buzz it in the coffee grinder. And sift to remove any large particles. One thing I would mention is that I've made this before using a dehydrator and found that the colors came out a little bit richer and more vibrant. So if you do have access to a traditional dehydrator, then that's what I'd recommend using. But for creating powders like this at home, your oven works perfectly fine. So there you have it, a beautiful velvety blackberry powder. If you haven't already, consider subscribing down below. And if you'd like to follow what I'm doing on Twitter or Instagram, you can find me at KAC Creative.